to play more aggressively inside that spot. Guys, what is going on? Instead of playing maybe avoiding the first Why when I show up late does my team lose cuz they need me to win? True. True. On that radar, everybody was still Hello, what is up chat? What's up? What's up, boys? What's up? Remember when I used to say that? What's up, boys? What's up, boys? How's it going? Zero respect for viewers' time. Okay, we had an emergency over here. Okay. I was just dealing with an emergency. Oh, now you feel bad. Now you feel bad. Four children died. I don't not related to anything I was doing. I'm just assuming in the world that happened. So, but anyway, it still was an emergency. Okay. Won every single engagement in that hallway. Yep. Here's what happened. Okay, here's why I'm late. Here's why I'm late. What up? Welcome to the stream. How's it going? First off, I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Today, Cutie got a groomer to groom Swift. The good type of groomer, not the Minecraft kind. And and she was busy recording Fear Ant podcast, so I was in charge of bringing the dog to the groomer. And and this is a pretty easy task, but I was, I was in a meeting, and and so like you know I, I, during my meeting I muted, and I brought Swift and I brought him over to the they have like a grooming van they do it in, and Cutie gave me a picture that I sent to the groomer I'm like make him look like this, and then he's like you want like the haircut I was like I pointed to his like toesies I'm like cut around here like the toesies. And then that was like, that was it, you know? Anyway, we get Swift back. Disaster. I thought he looked really, really cute. They shaved him. They shaved him. Which apparently you're not supposed to do to uh, it does not look like Swift. It does look like a different dog. And Swift also looks way younger. It looks cute. No, no, no. Don't get me wrong. I, I, they, they brought Swift back and the first thing out of the groomer's mouth is it's a little bit short. And I went, it is short, but he looks cute. Uh, and he looks a lot different. But Swift has a double coat. He is uh, an arctic dog. Uh, and he has a double coat. And dogs with double coats are not supposed to be shaved. I know this because Cutie told me five minutes after I showed her. And she was not pumped. Because apparently a double coated dog, uh, for one, regulates heat. Regulates heat via their coat. And so if you shave their coat, they're worse at regulating heat. They're not actually cooler. Did you get a refund? Not only did I not get a refund, I tipped 25%. <laughs> I tipped 25% because, first off, I didn't know any of this. I got the dog back and I was like, damn, that's a bit short. But, hey, I'm a rich millionaire. I'm not going to fucking dog you. And I was using Cutie's credit card. So, anyway. Cutie's distraught, understandably. I will leave a four-star review and say, hey, th they were really nice, but maybe you shouldn't go there if you have a double-coated dog because they don't know what they're doing. I gave them a pick, by the way. I want to clarify. I, I sent them a picture that they should model it after, and it does not look like the picture, simply said. Can we see the pick you sent them? Yeah. So, just to clarify, this is what Swift looks like now. Uh, and this is the picture I sent them. So, I, you know, 
on the defense too. Like, uh, whenever TWT's moving. I'm not going to pretend it's the greatest picture to ever exist, but like, the, you know, it is not the same. <laughs> it is. They don't take a damn expert to be like, yeah, it's no, we 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 saw your picture and then sh added shaving. They still have this operator that they can work with. I don't think he got shot the previous round, so they still have an opportunity of an element of surprise. Which All right, hold up, everyone, live watching MXS. Holds a tight angle to look down towards shot. So anyway, that's why I'm late. At the door with an op. Look, I'm not gonna say it's the greatest reference picture of all time, but yes. it, like it's all night and day for what happened. You know, I don't think the reference picture was the problem here. Neural theft activated. Mata slipping up, and a chance for TWT off this cosmic divide to secure. And wow, and the Viper's pit on top of that. This is their site, and this is going to be such a tough retake for MXS unless they can get around it. Well, I don't have any more flashes, so they have to rely on just bodies and trades. Yeah, it was cut by Foos cuts. So far, that's four versus three, and MXS are picking off. The players from the extremities. TWT have all these defenses. I mean, the cosmic divide is gone, but can Pecky says I'm remaining. the only one that matters. As long as this pit is up, the neural theft from Otis. Kill Cam Pecky. Yes, sir. The rat from the sewer. Two and rounds. We're doing better now. MXS, unless Otashima can defuse in time, should be good. Yeah. But wow, expensive. I like too. when Cypher throws his hat and uses his ult. It reveals his bald fucking head. Because I imagine it's like... There's a period of shame, like having to use his ultimate, it, because then he's gonna have his bald ass head walking around. And also, you saw how passively Pancakes was playing. He had a they used four ults and lost. Did they use four? They used Kanpeki's the ult. Uh, they used Astro Wall. Uh, they wait. Did they even use Astro Wall? Really they used Viper, Cipher, KO. So I like that MXS were anticipating that the they use a few. They did use Astros. Okay, guys, I look, I understand some of you guys watch the yard. All right, that's great. Great show. We are not going to be repeating the meme that I fuck my cat from the yard on the stream. Okay? All right? Yes, Slime likes purporting this. Okay? He also likes going to Las Vegas and blowing, you know, 10 fucking bands. Okay? I love my cat very dearly. I don't. Look. If it wasn't gonna be I don't enough, want. I don't want to ruin this. Fury, you know. TWT Otherwise, I'll just have to kick cat coots out of the stream room. Now with only two remaining, you did what? I didn't do anything. One the spike not in their hands. Can Pecky goes on a journey and comes out with nothing. So Mummy's gonna try and keep the weapon. And wow, even get some picks on some people who are getting a little greedy. Yeah, it's one HP though, and you got plenty of money for him. You're making it sound worse. I'm not making it sound worse. Slime said it's way worse than what I've said today. Slime said some gross stuff. Let's be real. But that was such a nice little change of pace for MXS, adding the aggression. So you saw vulgar motherfucker, vulgar. The same type of default as if they were playing it on an anti-eco. Once again, getting pinged out, getting noticed out, and then what we decided to do for MXS and Sen, it was actually starting to push on those angles, two towards the halls, two towards. A There's a timeout. All right, the basic, the basic gist is that Coots is in heat. She hasn't been spayed yet. I haven't uh, brought her to get spayed because she's been in heat so long, and. And, and she'll stay in heat much longer than normal. And the doctor was like, well, she does that if there's like an, a suitor. And for a while, I thought that suitor might be Swift and Coots might have the hot for Swift because Durs is a girl. And maybe Coots is like freaking lesbian. I don't know. But uh, but then recently, Coots started peeing on my clothes. And then Cutie, in part, also came to the conclusion that Coots is peeing on my clothes in his marking territory involving me. And so then Slime took that meme and said insanely crass stuff. He was talking about, I don't even want to repeat it. Yes, yeah, so my cat, my cat want me. Uh, and so anyway, I got to get her, I got to get her spayed. Look at his split. It's a little more dangerous to get a cat spayed when they're in heat. It's probably fine ultimately. So I might just rip it, but they just bleed more. 
And Odashima used to be a coach, so the fact that MXS could read the TWT like the sit and spawn, lean A hallway, or just lean A in general, MXS crunch them, just shows the intelligence and the understanding of the game that MXS have. Now playing a yeah, you're supposed to wait, but I've been waiting and it's been a while. Gonna dash in to be switch things up. Wow, they had a trip for the dash. I love when they put a trip for a high dash. So much visual clutter with the cages, with the viper wall, and TWT. They don't all want to funnel through the inside of that wall. Good try. That is how Vic and Brock. They're not gonna reswing Yamada. Let's be real. Killed that B offense for TWT last time. So TWT are trying to take their time. MX MXS stands for Moist X Shopify. Guy on the team is dead. AK will, but pancakes on the flank and Flya. Ready to spot this out, Just and did, well, yeah. all of them are looking at him. <laughs> yeah, I mean that's that's a great call right now. They, they think they have a timing. Unfortunately, Odashima a little confident. And didn't put put into account Mummy that was actually pushing up towards the yellow. But they do have pancakes in. Okay, no, this is good now. All three are trap site. This is great. Good KO ult. Yeah, just hoping that the retake you deal with the flanker then okay nice backside there we go good shit mata or, uh, the knives are out and gets to Tarek will not be joining us today Tarek is coming to LA I believe I don't I think to watch uh VCT in person maybe do some Red Bull stuff I don't know he's working but he messaged me he said hey I won't be able to watch this week I don't know why he messaged me to say that because it's not like last week like last week he also didn't watch you know bro you just leaked that wait what did I leak I'm just guessing <laughs> I'm he's coming to LA I'm assuming he's gonna watch VCT the person that was trying to create space inside the site was Will dashing once again, and unfortunately, the the path that he chose when he lands, he's he lands got a right final right mouse partnership. So despite the visual <laughs> oh yeah, it comes out on 420, <laughs> right? Smoke that good shit. Free kill the spam on the trap kill that you just brought up on the defense. So after that, you don't you don't think there's going to be a lot of players that's going to try to push out towards arches. Thank you, AD goes for the 17 side. months. Yeah, so no head. Thank you, the 25 months. Is supposed to be, uh, When's Freerin? Milkshake. I haven't finished the, it. Uh, Freerin is so... It's Man, I'm fighting, though. So I'm really trying to get through it. I'm at episode, like, 15. It's just long as shit, man. I'm trying. Do you like it? Yeah, I like it, yeah. I don't hate it. I like it. It's fine, yeah. That's no, good. It's good. It's good. It's like no, nah, it's great. It's great. Kind of played against a double controller in that setup of what you have the cages and the viper wall. Even though I know Oshima is in the controller, but I kind of felt like that. Mm. Now it's an early pit on the beast. I, I mean, currently I find some of the characters to be a little okay. bit one dimensional, you know? To A, but it's going to just be a quiet default. But really pushed up there is Mame. So I'm wondering who he can catch. Yeah, this is all just regular coordination right now on the attack. Smoke up the nest. Try to walk down and take mid control. Yeah, I don't mind. I, 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 I'm not lying. I do, I do like it. It's just... You know how your opponent is playing? There's a little gap in the smoke. You can watch towards the castle and potentially get the... Yeah, I'm not freaking... The timing. The smoke dissipated. Mata stuck in the corner. Forced to peek out. Almost got punished, but manages to dash away into safety. They got info that... Busting my little nuts to watch it, you know? There's a lot of pressure happening from... Imagine losing to a team called Twat. Dude, I just found out this week that the team's called TWAT. If you don't know, it's Together We Are Terrific. And their thing is TWT. But I never realized they made themselves that name because it stands for TWAT. Together We Are Terrific, TWAT. I didn't get it, no. How about you hit a shot there, Mata? Mata, how about you hit that shot for me? TWT can play off the advantage of time. Especially now that Neptune got a plant. Twat is a British insult. Uh, yeah, yeah. Going the core as well. Long range gets a dink on the frog. This is very good for TWT to capitalize the pulse plant here. Oh, they know where MXS, at least two of them, are coming from. And frog is quite low. Needs Mata to be. To really go big. Oh, it's Jover. You saved that gun. Coordinated on how to push that. 
and Brock will just try to conserve that op and TW. Please pronounce it correctly. You twat. After, uh, you twat. I don't know how a British person says it. Sorry, here's the thing. I have zero desire to sound more British. Do you think this challengers? Do you think this challengers your team have a chance? What the fuck is that sentence? Sorry. Uh, let's take a little time out. I wouldn't mind that. Let's take a little time out. Let's let's reduce, reuse, recycle. You should watch the first episode of Windbreaker. I don't know what that is. There's a lot of, of no, no, no. This, this, this month for Parasocial Club, we're we're not watching another anime show. We're gonna watch an anime movie. Uh, that way we can catch up a bit. Although, if you haven't uh, caught up, if you aren't in the Parasocial Club, this month we are reading. I am not a serial killer. That is the book we are reading. I am not a serial killer for the book club. Beat out. I am not. I am legend. Uh, yeah, this is O.J. Simpson's biography. No, it's, uh, it's, it's a fiction book about an author who's obsessed with serial killers, I think. Been a bit more back and forth on how the whole hallway engagement goes, but so far, maybe TWT can just fall back on that. But so Why far, is VLC Media Player on your team? Okay, his player. name is Vic. See, that's for real, though. Not VLC. Too, it's, uh, it's also Although, what a great uh, media player, huh? That, that really Shout out VLC. Really God damn. Rate top three challengers teams. MXS, Oxygen, M80. But I don't know where M80 lies in there. That wasn't necessarily ordered. I don't know the order. But the top three is very obvious. Nobody would say anyone else is in the top three, I think. Although Turtle Troop did very well. They 2 0 TSM yesterday. They looked really good, Turtle Troop. M80 could be number one, but they haven't played Oxygen or MXS. So it's like, how do you call yourself number one if you haven't played two or three, you know? And MXS beat Oxygen, so like... Uh, yeah. It's like two or three opportunities that he had that he actually didn't get. So it What's your thoughts on Drake's huge snake? Thank you, thank you, Joel West B for the membership. Is tier two roster locked at any point? Uh, I don't know. It's a good question. I, I actually literally don't know the answer. Shout out, hey Ra Ra, please. Shout out, hey Ra Ra. How come it's not called the Moist Moguls? Because we combined with Shopify and the Moist X Moist, uh, the Moist X Moguls X Shopify didn't sound good. Fall together. The TWT taking different angles this time. Going through mid. Still need to collect the spike, but you know, Kid Pick has some work to do to cover their back. Where, 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 now where, 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 11 seconds left. The plan will go down. Now neuro theft from Mummy in the three versus two. Where is this? Oh, did he? Did he not see that? Oh wow. Gets taken care of on that was crazy from Will FPS. Will this round, and TWT just have to close out. Yeah, especially when the camera sees Mada here. So That's tough. Thank you, Bray, Pixel Titan, Snick. Thank you to $5, Josh. Played Vic Mata, B Dog, in a TDM today. Glad I could warm your team up. I would appreciate an apology from Vic for shitting on me, though. <laughs> Thanks for warming him up. Appreciate that. Thanks to all the memberships, guys. Will you do a watch party of the Moist Apex team at next month's LAN? Next month's LAN, it's May 5th, right? It's the same. It's May fifth, May third through fifth. It's the same weekend as uh. It's the same weekend as uh Miami F one. I might be able to. I actually would. I would. I would kind of like watching it. I don't know if I'll stream it per se. I have almost no Apex knowledge, but I might watch it with uh Kelby. That might be fun. Just offline though. Shopify the e-commerce. Yeah, we partnered with Shopify. So it's basically Moist X Shopify. Shopify used to have a team. We had a team. We combined our teams. So Brock and Flya were, were on our team last year. Mata and Vic were on Shopify's team last year. Odashima was, was Odorous, who was our coach at Moist. And now we've combined uh, to be more powerful together. And then it also helps uh, afford it, too.
feet on the rope. It's mine. We're working on New Jerseys. Look how far pushed up he is. And he's been punished on this aggression before. Except Will Charlie join in the watch parties? I haven't heard from him, but I think at, hopefully at least when playoffs start for sure. Because uh, I think he keeps up. I mean, MXS is like one of the... They're really fucking good, man. Oh! Oh! The man at the back is Brock. Now TWT don't even have a spike anymore. Nice. And also, no more lives. Mana picks up the last Thief and Volta. Sim and a Proto all have new teams, by the way. Uh, Sim and a Proto are actually teaming together on TSM. Uh, and they both look very promising. They both look to be like they're, they're, they're they still look very strong, and and I think TSM has a lot of potential. Uh, although they they haven't been together that long. And then uh, Thief is on YFP. YFP, another challengers team. And Thief, you know, I mean, Thief still. So they all got a squad. OJ died, Lud. I mean, look, I wasn't the biggest uh, fan of his work. And the flash is beautiful. Mata. Try to slip into enemy lines. You got the Hunter's Fury corralling. TWT in spawn. It's deja vu, and the spike is One down. TWT remaining. trying to fight back, but it's just MXS that's on top. I will say OJ was a part uh, of the pain a story that will almost Roll never be forgotten. Because uh, he, uh, he was a part of the Buffalo Bills, you know? A team that went to four back-to-back-to-back-to-back Super Bowls and lost every single one. A thing that will almost never be broken. A world record that will stand the test of time. So, you know, for that reason alone. Not gonna allow for you to do anything right now for TBT to salvage that round. Very nicely done for MSS towards the end on that aggression around the Hunter's Fury and dropping the spike. That's the second. That's all you got? Well, to be fair, that's all the Buffalo Bills got is a record of four back to back to back to back losses because they never got to bring home a Super Bowl. Um, but you know, this year I think Josh Allen and Stephon Diggs can do it. Oh. <laughs> oh. Wait. Oh. 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 Uh, no one's come close to his record of yards per game. Yards per game, he's he's kind of nuts. The Bills traded Diggs to the Texans? Really? Wait, oh my god, if I knew that, I wouldn't have brought it up. That's so embarrassing. I can't believe he got that plant off. I can't believe he got that plant off. The plant is down, but MXS are worth spoked off from their spike. So it was a bit of panic. Wait, what is the game plan here? What's the fucking game plan? And force MXS into a small area. It's gonna be tough. They swing as What the was the game plan? And what a reaction. Okay, looks like the game plan was have one person plant, have three play for main, and then have a late lurk mid. They had an even later, I guess not a lurk, but an even later rotate from B. So that that lurk didn't really help, but then they just got completely shut off from main almost instantly. Yeah, they were trying to play mollies in lineups. I'm sure. I guess they. I guess they're they're trying to play it like, hey, if we get bombed down, we'll probably win post plant. But I feel like they needed more people to be playing from the left side than the right side. And they also had a flank, in, and that was going to kill them in two seconds too. That's tough. Who do you think is going to win the NBA championship? It's time for the Boston Celtics to take it down for the first time in 15 years. The Boston Celtics are going to crush through. But their thing is usually coming back a few rounds later. Anti Eco and Man Pink. King Celtics takes one for the road. All the action. Okay, are they going to win the Eco? 
They have a bulldog now. And they have bomb down. And they have man advantage. It looks like they're going for a pretty quick retake. Neptune's already on site. Look at that. Look how close he is on the map. He's right next to... Oh, headshot. That's huge. Wait, what? How did that happen? Damn, we got melted. I mean, it's a good eco. Bomb down, you're happy. And we got we got three guns off them. And we got rid of uh, at least one extra armor. So that's not bad, but... The Celtics are tied in championships with the Lakers right now. Dude, a Lakers Celtics. I'm not even kidding. If the Lakers and Celtics, it's it's almost there's almost like a zero percent chance this happens. If it is a Lakers Celtics finals, I think I would go to every game. Cutie's pretty pissed on the timeline. Oh, she's fuming. I, I mean, she's, to be fair, just very nervous about her dog. What if it's Clippers Celtics? I'll go to a game. Looks like they might try to I'll go to the LA ones. Uh, later on, sorry, towards this A site. It's gonna be thunder. Trust me. Okay, Someone now you're smoking. Each other on the other side of the Astro wall. No one wanted to cross it this time. Pancake says, "Bring it on. I gotta judge." How does MXS normally yeah, MXS do on Breeze? Will, uh, Breeze was MXS's pick, right? Like this is our map pick. Judge at that doorway. I assume we picked it because we have a very good T side, or at least in scrims we do. Uh, and so far, it seems like we're really good at getting bombed down. It's a real gun round, so let's just see how it works. We have two people up halls. Oh, wow. What a, what a pop. What an execute. That was kind of impressive. We've already sent Brock to do his job. Go play. 4v2 now. That split A was that was cute. Watching over like a bird on his perch. Waiting for pancakes to get in position from mid. It's gonna be a tall task when What VCT team do you think you could beat? I mean look, I'm not trying to fucking make enemies here. M I B R M I B R M I B R M I B R. I'm not trying to make enemies out here. Weapon upgrades at least and C9. I'm not trying to make enemies out here. If I can. Even Mata heard the uh, weapon switch uh, just at under him when he was actually trying to push up towards the hall. So he knows that there was potentially somebody that was going to watch for the exits from the bottom middle. So MXS is ready for that. They're grouping up together. They're really Don't come to Brazil. Time, just to make sure they ain't bad. I didn't say they're bad. Working as a group. You can definitely see here that, you know, you, you can't really chase down those kills because it was an expensive buy. The question wasn't who's bad. For your gun round for MXS. So I like that all Can you beat tens? One on one? Really Probably. Here for no team, maybe utilize five on five? No. Up from that previous round and maybe buy around it too, right? This is going to be uh, a very important decision to make for TBT if you want to uh, if you want to force through that. And even if you lose that round, you still have a chance to come back. How old Swift? Eleven. It's we're still very early into the second half. It's only an eight to seven score line. So going for a gamble with a buy is not too bad of a thing, especially here at this point. They juggled. The Could you beat tens in a fist fight? Will went for. Uh, I think the thing about tens is he's so maxed towards shooting games so like that ninety five percent of games I think I beat him at. Like I feel like I cook his ass in Mario Kart. Try to get the best out of it. Yeah, I was wondering if Will, Will was going to get a weapon or was just, like you said, going to... I say this way. I think I actually just wiped this from my memory. I played him in Street Fighter. He cooked my ass. Didn't really see much, you know. Never mind. Astro Stars covering that up. So, MXS on a really slow and quiet default. What about Zekin? I'd crush him in melee. Around B, but MXS have had success at A before. We'll see if they'll be able to get the order. It looks like an A fake and B. Yeah, that, that was the plan. Or maybe just grabbing it for the ult. And a B execute with ult to get rid of the cipher util. 
success. We're at the minute mark. We're trying to figure out what type of util is going to be coming out too. If they're going to try to throw another cycle of a knife, Neptune's about Looks to like we pulled a rotate off, off of B. Main, and look at that instant pivot from MX, MXS. Okay, the knife didn't hit anybody. They're swapping. Try to gamble towards a B Jets rotate. going B, Cypher's going A. I didn't try to go for a hit, but I love this forward push from Neptune. Oh, wow. Wait, they're all leaving A. And get more information there, but this still we basically have all of A. <gasps> okay. This oh, is free as it gets. They all left. Out the wrong way. Yeah. Heard someone talking, wanted to hear what was up, but it makes sense. What is up? This is Tom Brady said he wouldn't be opposed to playing game. again. <laughs> and already modern afford position eyes on the a hole. What a fucking <laughs> Maybe getting Dude, spotted. Dude, just become governor of Boston, you know what I mean? Drone. Go become now mayor of fucking away. Massachusetts. The hallway was all I mean controlled by TWT, but can Pecky pushed up. Got Start the political career. It's going to happen. So MX has to force TWT to just conserve their guns because when routes are this close, economy is everything. How about mayor of Kissin's son Kissin? Okay. You know, the the situation you're facing in that round number 16 for TWT, you had a lower buy, you only had a sheriff in the hands of Neptune, you're trying to... Oh, we're hunting. We're hunting wabbits. Bring those rifles in favor of the other four Call me Jermaine the way I'm hunting rabbits. Sorry, that joke was inappropriate. I take that joke back. I feel like that could have offended people. That's not in my character. Uh, right. 8-8, eight, eight, baby. Tie the game up. When you have all these positions that are a lot more clean on the full spike for MXS on the A side on uh, on attack than it was for their positioning on defense on the A side. So now we have a tie game 8 to 8. Uh, we are still trying to buy around what we currently saved on that <laughs> previous round. So uh, Who's the IGL? It's a uh, flyer. They still have these free rifles and they're looking at the pressure now working down towards the middle. Will avoids the recon guard also move down towards castle. And this gives a chance for a pop flash later on for mid if they need it here on the crossfire setup from Neptune. There's the camera from Odashima spotting anyone that's going near B who is going through mid. Swing that shit. Swing that shit. You're going to die. Swing that shit. Behind by MXS. Aldrin to check out A main and then you got Mata almost in the defender's spot. Vic is surrounded by a bunch of dudes right now. Wait for the perfect timing before crossing that or at least Makes it look like he's not there. Now takes care of the trip. That's crazy. That's crazy he got that. Ooh, wow, what a headshot. Campecki with a flick. That moment, still not a favorable round for TWT. As MXS have a lot of options. All the kills only happened at mid. 5v3 and Campecki's lit. Oh, you got to finish that. You got to finish that. B's an easy hit here. Mentioned and praised how he's good. 30 on this seconds map left as a cipher about to get contested towards B. Oh, Is that our smoke or their smoke? I assume it's their smoke. C9 creative director in chat, he heard your call out. Oh, about us winning five on five? Like this, at least pancakes would like to, but. Making their way slowly towards <laughs> B. Ken Pecky is getting pushed. I mean, I, respect, I appreciate him here in the call out, but Ken like. Pecky don't want that smoke. They're at half health. Let's see if they can take one to the grave with them, holding this angle. I don't know exactly where they are. What's the Ken damned Pecky creative director gonna do? Early shot. You gotta get Oxy in here. Scared and Ken Pecky gets found at the end of the day, and Pancakes will keep their gun, like I said. Yeah. I feel that there's almost two by the Christmas lights, lights they look cute the uh, in order for them to, to lose we have an Astra it's a good point control that they had very early in who are you bringing in a 5v5 basketball a game against Valorant teams I think no meme there's not a single Valorant VCT professional who beats me in a one-on-one -on -one basketball but that one time he decides I don't think there's one some whatever reason it was because you know Neptune should have been the contact already at mid double doors. He gets caught then right after by Vigs jump on the top of the box at Castle and gets dropped. Zekin so played in high school. Dude. <laughs> in terms of how 
They weren't able to hold the He's 5 foot 4. The aggressive position that he held out for TWT. Secondly, 97 pounds. About to right here. So he walks for for some odd reason decides to walk back and then get caught because the the one moment that he doesn't walk on the walk up those castles. What about Zelsus? But, but then the other one for TWT for for Mummy that's inside the I think I cook him. He's about to play against four players entering towards that site. And you know, Pinkcase was trying to mean well, I guess, by throwing that smoke down towards the left side of the ladder. But that hallway... So I, look, I don't think there's a, a soul out there beating me one-on-one. -on -one. Definitely. Find me a VCT a pro with a on his end, so he who's beating me. Over that and couldn't anchor or, or get his one or two and done that he's actually really good for in these moments. Uh, so, uh, you know, two two great errors that were capitalized by MXS to take the lead now in this game, forcing the timeout of TWT. Okay, I'm not going to lie, though. Like, I know this is ultimately really bad, what happened with Swift. He looks so cute, though. <laughs> I know it's bad, and he's not supposed to look like this. He looks like a sheep. More like a lamb, Either I would say, but. Damn, Mata. That's a free B site. Look at this late lurk from Odashima right now. A very late lurk. They're going for a fast retake. This is Odashima's round to win. Odashima, did you win the 1v1? What the fuck? Okay, hold up. It is losable. Never mind. Never mind. Joseph said Alphager and Rooney. Are these VCT players? This bro's European. The concussion that was real, that was used by pancakes was a little Sorry, I'm at NA. Nobody is really ready to I think I said it earlier. I should have VCT NA. Back against uh the players on, I'll the, find on the back lines of MXS on the pulse plan. So, there was a little bit of uh, Rooney's C9? C9 Rooney. And it just allowed better crossfire setups and better trades here for MXS in the end. Uh, Bro looks actually very tall. <laughs> God, okay, this guy looks six foot five for TWT. Yes, I'll have a blade storm for Will, trying to leverage that towards potential. He's six six. I still think I cook him. But now he's pivoting back towards a holes to really help his team. Because the thing about my game is it's not really built around like a height advantage. It's built just around really good fundamental basketball with change of pace uh, takes. He only has a sheriff to work with, right? So that's going to be very difficult to play close range with that too. And Mata just gave the op to Brock, and he says, hold this. I'm going he was D1? <laughs> now you're making shit up. There's no way he was a D1 I'm basketball player. Is what I Are you being for real? MXS starting their setup around B. Odashima, you look silly. He was actually D1? MXS. So but is it like, no, it's D1's D1. I'm, I'm trying to undermine it. D1's just D1. Waiting for help. And Will popping the blade store. He, he did not play for D, he did not play for Duke. Wait, Flya? Wait, Flya with a huge clutch. Flya getting ult and then removing knives and using the ult for that is so sick. You couldn't beat a high school basketball player? Wait. It depends on the high school. If it's Chino Hills Varsity, maybe not. If it's Bedford, New Hampshire? I mean... I got a good shot there. I got a good chance. Now we finally have off on both sides. Brock has it on the attack. Will has it on the defense. And he's actually set up for mid control. Changing gears. Initiating and engaging towards the east side. Yeah, this is a fast hit out of MXS. Mata's wasting no time. Got eyes on the door. 
Good entry kill. Good ult. Damn, our T side is good. We lost two pistols. We have won five straight rounds. I get why we picked this map. Just some great calls, I think, honestly. Five rounds in a row in this half. Two rounds away from taking the first map with TWT. One enemy remaining. Just going toe to toe and MXS. Shooting the body? Was that a tea bag? Oh, no. Oh, no. Would I be Charlie one on one? I don't know. Charlie's been playing a lot. I mean, I watched Charlie play against Jinxie. I'm certain it wasn't their finest moments in basketball history. But they that looked winnable. That match, yeah, that match looked tough. <laughs> I don't, I, I'm assuming that was Charlie's, not his A game. But if that's his A game, then I, I think I cook. You lose to Germa? Yeah, that's because if he snaps, my body melts into a puddle. To deny that out from MXS. One round away from taking Dude, the, map. the ult in halls this looks so weird. Neptune holds close at A. Looking at from outside looks like a bunch of high schoolers hot boxing a car in a parking lot. Will hold, but how long will with cartoonish green gas uh, oozing out. Hold at B. Which is good, right? That that pit is also to just deny the amount of times that they were able to lurk on the attack for MXS. They have a trip down at the bottom doors, so the two players on the east side can just focus on holding the What would you know about hot boxing? Jack shit. Really happening on the B side. Except for, the I would go to my high school parking lot and watch people hotbox. <laughs> uh, I actually know it from the same perspective I'm speaking on it. Solo anchor hold around the trip set up here by Mummy, while his responsibility is to watch spawn side very 30 passively. seconds so left you're not aggressing too much you're playing time in your favor on the defense but you hope that the util that's been placed here on the defense is damn did not clear left why are we not clearing left that's crazy it was just i guess we really thought we pulled the rotates we can win this round clipped their wings are clipped. As soon as they dash in, the rest were like, oh, nope. I guess we might as well go. Mata started it. And now that'll be a surviving round out of TWT. Oh, yikes. That close from closing it out. Yeah, we didn't see that last shot. You versus Brock, Sheriff. Who wins? Me, any gun, Brock using a Sheriff? I think I win. But only if I get to set the stage. Like, if the matchup is... Like, in aim duel, he wins. But if it's like, I am... Like, imagine the if the match is the entirety of the map. I would just sit with a judge on a site. And I think that would work. I beat Tarek. Guys, okay, I'm, I'm pretty freaking good at video games. So put a little respect on my name. Mata, what's the game plan? Mata, don't get greedy for this kill on Campeki. There we go. Nice. Oh, I wish he got that kill. I wish he got that kill so badly in my heart. Brock, ult. Damn, good knife. Oh, this flank's great. MXS! Dude, I'm not gonna lie. T side looked kind of free. Am I crazy? That looked kind of easy. They, we kind of dog walked them. We lost a pistol. We lost a bonus. We lost one extra round. We won eight other rounds. Kind of dog walked them. Thank you, Jarl.
for the membership. Hair looking good today? Dude, I'm saying. I did it last night. Why did I say Odorous is his name? His tag is Odorous, but he's been going by Odoshima. I don't know why the Odoshima change was made. Maybe he's in the Wano arc of One Piece, but... Any dinner recommendations? Just in general, or like, are you in a specific area of the world? Or are you talking about any food at all, at all, ever, at all? Here's what I like to do. You you get, uh, get, uh, get some penne pasta. Boil it. Ten minutes. Little salt in the water. Classic. Drain it. Splash it with just like a hint of olive oil. And then throw two jars of canned tuna inside that bitch with a big hefty serving of Kewpie mayo. Season to taste. Season to taste. I, I think that shit's yummy. All right, here's my other meal. Here's my, that's such a white meal. <laughs> I hate the white meal comments. Because you know what you would never say? That's such a black meal. <laughs> you know? I don't think that sentence would come out of your mouth. What other types of meals are there, chat? Let's go through the list. <laughs> what's a... What's such an Asian meal? I have another meal, though. You know, this is getting me... Oh, let's play a little food guesser. All right, we got yogurt, rice, dried mint, eggs, flour, water. What the fuck? Like a little soup? Okay, nobody does yogurt better than India, so I'm going to give it to them. I'm warm, but I'm not there. This dish is made by boiling rice with water. Oh, wait. Oh, I'm dumb. This is Spanish, no? I guess it says kind of warm right now. What do you call that shit? There's a Spanish dish, which is just rice uh, cooked in milk. Uh, my mom used to make it. Fuck, what do you call that shit? Aris, 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 aris con leche. Uh, but that's more of like a sugar, like a sweet thing. This doesn't seem sweet. It seems more... This dish is uh, seasoned with salt and pepper. Yeah, it seems a little more savory. Uh, if India's warm, then maybe it is a Middle Eastern country. Well, how about I go... India's warm. It's to the west of India. It's not bordering. It's not Pakistan. Maybe... Maybe Iran? Oh. Bank it. Spot on. Dovka. is a traditional Azerbaijan... Uh, uh, Azerbaijani and Iranian dish made of yogurt, rice, and herbs. What's the dish I'm thinking of? It's a, a, a rose con leche. I was right. Except I didn't know the word for rice. Okay, what do we got? We got white beans, onion, garlic, smoked meat, such as bacon or ham hock, paprika, salt, pepper. Smoked meat. Meat. Smoked meat. This looks great. This looks just fucking delicious. I got... This looks yummy. Okay, we got beans, onion, garlic, smoked meat. Who invented smoking meats? I don't know the answer to that. It feels like an American thing, but I also just think I'm giving us that. I don't know if we deserve that per se. Beans does beget Britain in the head, but I just can't believe for a moment the British would season their food with a bay leaf. I don't think they know what bay leaves are. I don't think they have the ability to season like that. White bean, onion, garlic, smoked meat. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go European country, but I want to go more of a Eastern European country, like a hearty. Like I imagine you eat this hunched over with a piece of bread in your left hand, and just your right hand's just fucking eating it direct. You know. Uh, I would like to go. Russia might be a bit far. I'll go Ukraine, just for starters. I'm warm. Okay. It's west of Ukraine. It could be like a Czechoslov a Chechia, a Chechia angle. It's hot. We're close to Chechia. It could be like a Croatia, Slovenia, a Slovenia angle. It borders Slovenia to the south. 
So it is Croatia. It, it is Croatia. Croatia, Serbia, Montenegro. Bosnia and Herzegovina. Okay. All right, we get, we got there. It took us a bit. I was in, I think, the right spirit. Uh, Pasulj, a traditional bean soup popular in the Balkans, particularly Serbia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hearty, nutritious, made with white beans. This, I mean, it looks great. It looks great. I got zero complaints. Uh, what in the fuck is this 240p image? I can't tell if it's sweet or savory or what the... All right, let's just read it then. Eggs, vegetables, such as bean sprouts, green onions, and mushrooms. Meats, such as pork, chicken, and shrimp. Soy sauce, salt, pepper, cooking oil. Uh, I mean, it looks like a damn omelet. Right? I don't know. It looks like an omelet. Uh, the, so, soy sauce, bean sprouts, green onions... Feel like are more Asian uh, ingredients. Asian uh, countries would use those ingredients more. I'm just gonna rip a China. It's egg fu young. We get there. Uh, egg fu young is a Chinese dish made with beaten eggs and various ingredients such as meats, vegetables, and sometimes seafood. It's cooked in a pan like an omelet, served with a sauce. From the Guangdong province. Look at that. Immigrated to America. Or excuse me, introduced to America via Cantonese immigrants. Final score, 13,000. I mean, that's a great score. Average score today is 10K. We're killing it. We're killing it. Uh, All right. I mean, I guess this means we got time for a Wordle. Hold up. I got to get fucking U-Block Origin back. Respectfully, New York Times is inundating me with ads. Penis. I'm starting to think the word penis is a bad starting word. Sure. How about Morse? Like Morse code. No, it can't be. Uh, how do I do this one? Could it end? Like, close. No, it can't be close. I'm going to do it anyway. Just for some information. Okay. So we have all the letters. Except for one. Sorry. L-O-S-E. The O can't be in the middle. The L can't be in second spot. Where is the O then? Is it at the start? Probably not. Loose. Like loose change. L what? What the hell is Laos? What the hell is this? Laos. Either of two small wingless parasec parasitic insects that live on the skins of... It's the plural for lice? It's the singular of lice. That's crazy. That's crazy. I can't believe I got the word. I mean, I'm lucky that I went to for loose. Because I, I did not know that word. All right. Thank you for the 20 gifted, Josiah Price. Okay. New York Times mini crossword. I want to fucking get this fast, baby. Beat it. Uh, Michael Jackson. Scared. Uh, sacred. Uh, uh, the Tory Shrines. How anchovies are typically preserved. Cans. Cans. It's canned. Can, can, pasta, that's totally tubular, uh, penne, uh, beat it, what do you mean beat it, Michael Jackson, song, send via FedEx, ship, 
Cup or Cup or Cone? Uh, all by herself, alone. Arranging in a knot. Uh, tie the knot. Uh, with with the knot. One of fourteen on a roly poly bug. Uh, one fourteen dots, spots, marks. Beat it, scat. Scram, sc beat it, sc beat it, beat it, scat. What is scat? A uh, sacred hole. <laughs> oh, holy. <laughs> okay, uh, it's in. How are anchovies typically preserved? In oil. Uh, beat it. E. E. Yin. Tying. Tying. What was that even? Leg? One of 14. Oh, really? Pulley bugs have 14 legs. That's crazy. And then egg, you beat it because you beat the egg. Okay. All right. Hey, that wasn't too bad. 92. I'm happy with the 92. I know a lot of people get sub minutes, sub 30 seconds. That ain't me. New York Times Connections is though. We got Mermaid, Pixie, Clown. No. Channel. No. Watch. Compass. Ruler. Scale. Things you look at intently. King. Clown. Colonel. Mermaid. Leaders of men and women alike. <laughs> Buzz, bowl, crew, pixie. Haircuts I got as a child. Channel, line, main, pipe, things I do on a Saturday. <laughs> Easy, bro. I got so lucky. I got so lucky. That's it. <laughs> I, got, I can't believe how lucky I just got. I didn't cheat. I swear to God. I just got really lucky. I genuinely thought these were connected. Uh, based off like holding things and studying them. And this one was a meme. This one I just got lucky on. It was a meme. But I knew this one the whole time. This one I did not know. But I probably would have got there. Droid Cello, think of the 20 gifted. I, it's a pretty easy week. It's a pretty easy week, to be fair. All right. Should we make our lives fuck it? You know, let's do Bandle. Let's do Bandle. I'm electric today. Did that shit on the drum and bass line. My loneliness is killing me and Weird I... Was his best day on the dailies when chat doesn't go emote only. Dude, not a soul in chat knew that was... Uh, oops, I did it again. Uh, look, man. Hey, you don't have to give it to me, your honor. I just happen to be electric. Baby, baby. Hey, Slime. I like you too, man. I hope you're feeling better, you little rascal. You little dog. I would like to go from the Central African Republic to Liberia. Okay, that's not going to be easy, but I can get you there. We're going to have to really throw Nigeria in the mix. It's the biggest country in the center. We don't even have to go through Nigeria. Maybe we have to go around. Maybe that's better. Like, what if we go through Mali? Right? What if we go north around through Mali? Because then we could hit the South Sudans of the world. Uh, which is on the wrong fucking side. Son of a bitch. How about just straight up Sudan? Also unnecessary. Okay, this is lovely. 
All right, we need to go from Liberia to Mali. What what about what about love? You ever been in love? What about Sierra Leone? What about Senegal? Give me Ghana. And then give me Togo. And then give me Ghana, Togo, starts with a B, Benin. Okay. So I got these. What what countries are next to them? I was missing the Ivory Coast and Cameroon. I think I could have gotten there. Hold up. I think I could have done this. I forgot about Niger, which is fair. I should have known that because Nigeria uh, is right next to it. Uh, Chad, Chad's the one I would have needed, though. You had it in two? Yeah, I was two off. It was a toughie. It was a toughie. Give me a world. Let me myself. Wait. Isn't that just Molly? Sorry, I didn't mean Molly. I meant, isn't this just. <laughs> Where the. F this must be a tiny country. Uh, okay, wait. What's going on in, like, Venezuela? Is that close? No, it's still not close. Okay, is Ecuador close? No. It's way, wait, 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 wait. I'm being dumb. It's like Guatemala. Guatemala. All right, one final cost total. We're looking at a Latour Bakery Organic Hawaiian Honey Bread. Okay. 2x22 ounce. So two loaves of bread. And it's the Hawaiian honey bread. I mean, it can't be too much. I, I assume this has to be like at most $5. I'm going to go $4.99. Way up. I was going to say at most this is $7. This is a fucking $9 loaf of bread. It's, it's $7. Damn! I guess it's two loaves. I guess it's two loaves. How much is like a Sara Lee loaf of bread? Isn't that like three bucks? They play, this is kind of similar to their bind comp, just minus the sky. So they're very comfortable with it, with this initiator setup. Um, but yeah, kind of a different it's organic. last time that they played Lotus. Yeah, if anything, Maybe it's just me. If I read organic on a package, I might as well have just not read it because I throw it out the window. It means nothing to me. I don't care if it says organic. I don't believe it means anything. Like, what does that mean when they say, what does that mean? What is organic? That right, he's already setting up on this A sign to, to get over terrific. Though, are starting yeah. things off by sometimes I feel like organic is just a dumb tax towards the front of the B site. They're already pinging out too, just to get Rian on the first contact. But at the same time, MXS, there. they're about to walk into oh, you're about to get fucking hurt. This is gonna be a brutal yeah, nade combo. This is gonna be so brutal. We're gonna die. There's so many of us are gonna get killed. Get out of there. Generations from now are going to talk about the MXS massacre that occurred on April 11th. 411, dude. Never forget. Holy shit. You know, it's kind of crazy, though. That's the amount of people who die that, like, sparked the Revolutionary War. Time, though, for MXS, it seems as though they, they wanted to try to, to, to try something different, right? Maybe trying to figure out where the KJ Utah is. Uh, walk in front of info. Okay. Okay. Was trying to teleport out. Just got smoked. It was a Boston Massacre around, yeah. So now an opening. And so now we're going to start our Revolutionary War of crushing. And winning the game. Is on something today. On a tear. MXS. Is this a thrifty? One through CT, one through waterfalls. We have a nade. On top of that, because they got that first kill onto pancakes, the seas was thrown a little bit too early. Can we jump spot? Can we jump spot waterfall? Dude, you shouldn't. I didn't love your spot there. A little outlaw action from Mame. Seen just 
what he can do. Ooh, that's a great on, uh, aftershock. But tougher in how Not much util. Is. You know, <laughs> but Rob, missing that flash, but this is almost unwinnable is for Mummy. Doing work. I don't think this is really confusable. But see how many Yikes! Stack up, loses that to fly and damn wait winning round two is so much better than winning round one that's not aftershock oh yeah that's the ult what's it called got gooped by a dizzy and lots of ghosts and classic shots just took him down and again because that first player fell down if you think about it the revolutionary war was a thrifty yeah but then you start to get into the rabbit hole of using gaming terms to describe war and then the pain shells can do anything anymore, so it allows here for MXS to find that timing, triple swing in the Dude, the tea party was actually just packet loss if you think about it. It's a, it's a full counter to what Pancakes is right currently doing on the C side. And look at the amount of util that's being thrown on C. Like already a um a prowler came out at the same time. Lots of utils being used. Although this is uh, an eco that we currently have for T V T, so it's under five people stacked A side. This is gonna be a, a bloody battle. TWG, I mean, they used util as sand mounds. They go, let's go B now. Let's go B. Fuck it. Spotted MXS. That was gonna be nah, you're right. That was stupid. Now, well that was stupid. And with first blood, is MXS with the spike planted up on ropes. TWG's retake potential. There's a prowler coming down those steps. Mata keeps eyes on ropes ready to convert. Oh, yeah? What else? Oh! 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 Mata three with the Zenny Flawless. Now that was what three kills with the ghost. Then you have three kills with the phantom. You already have a hundred. Oh, sorry. 100. Yeah, you're right. They do have pistols. I forgot about that. Ready against TWT in their gun round. So that's how you steamroll two rounds in a row from Mata, who again has picked up the pace. Really Mata ain't getting raised, if breeze map where he created that space. He's landing his shots, and you don't really need the opera in your hand. Mata's electric, man. Like that. You're, I love when Mata plays hot. Dumb. Just hold it down and creating that space uh, by satcheling in and just grabbing those spots in those four positions. So, very, very well done. Let's see this round. Well, this is impact. There you go. We are a bit allergic to pistol rounds. This is a good movement. This movement's crazy. What is this movement, Ice? Right where the sun don't shine. Spike down. I'm excess. When the explosive opening. Wait, why'd she say where the sun don't shine? She's talking about buttholes. Seemed a bit ready. Mata! Mummy. He did more help in that moment, but Will was coming out. I can't take Mummy's name seriously because it sounds like Stewie Griffin calling for his mother, Lois Griffin. As MXS with time on their side, just need to be careful once the brim smoke. Oh, that smoke is so clutch. Now just use this omen one as cover. Either way, MXS have all their bases covered. Dude, Mata. No, if you got that kill, it'd be so disgusting. Until now, I guess. Still a win's a win for MXS. It's GG, bro. We got a molly on it. Get out of there. Can't even! Menemos. Think of the 22 months. If you're also leveraging Vic to do to do like uh, lineups with the Molly from Rubble from any type of spot here that can really Where can I download this games? Like like Valorant? Riot.com or something. Mata's playing good right now. With the players just behind here to close the gap on the double satchels in the site. I think that's beautifully done right now, and that's a method behind the madness of how aggressive you want to be. I think it's a seven months buzz cut. Is your name Twat on purpose? Yeah, you almost never trip into Twat. It's usually intentional. Never mind, I don't love it anymore. I don't love it. They just shot it there. Brock just kind of knew. <laughs> That's crazy. They heard it. They smelt it. They dealt with the problem. Oh, so. speaking of Flintstone gummies. Right there. MXS. Right there. They like to really cause a commotion at Sand Mound. Now, TWT. I'm a come a come a come a come a come a come come come. Was throwing a paint shell when MXS wanted to go B. But I don't think MXS are going to fall for that again. Not anymore. No, for sure. For sure not, right? <laughs> for sure not, right? Right. Nah, right. it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. They, they, if we go B, we're fucked. For sure. They're the four stacked they B. They have scan. 
Uh, initiator still with Brock. They could still use a scratch just in case if they wanted to. So you're just making sure that you're dodging all your eyes and crossing all your T's. But even at this spot, uh, you're moving towards the C site. This door could be open. They could try to do a seasoning through there. They're choosing otherwise. You're gonna seasoning from the waterfall here for TWT. Nice trip, Sotoshima. So 30 seconds left. Door could open right behind. Sotoshima will be on duty to walk oh. for that. MXS with a quick plant and the picks from the B door. Brock with three this round. MXS. They just take over these engagements and TWT can't put a good dent remaining. into them until the sheriff from Neptune had something to say about it. That's some money that close from TWT heard as well, but. Popping edibles during streams crazy. I'm not popping edibles. Ludwig, we are 7 and 19 on pistols this split so far. 5 and 6 for Soxygen, 2 and 4 against Core, 0 6 against Thinking Man, and 0 3 against TWT. Uh, the biggest thing is the downwards trend. We have not won a pistol since Core. Right in your smoke on that half wall of C site, yet still being discovered by Brock. I mean, that's that's some gamer sense right there from the initiator out of MXS. And that pulls out. Thank you, the Swedish Kroner. Shout out Ocarina of Time speedrunning. Shout out. You have to at this point because, again, this is the first time really that you're seeing MXS pull this out. You have to try to adapt as soon as possible. They're realizing that there's a lot of speed. Bank folks, Jody. Thank you, the subs. Memberships. They continuously had to fight against. What well, makes a team good at pistol? On the C side, so I think you, you have like different game around. plans for pistol. For example, pistol. like they had a really good game plan, TWT, for pistol that round. It was using raise nade and fade suck to uh, to get like a lot of damage when they tucked behind B site or at, like B entry or whatever. So I think that they just had a good plan, or it's just being really good at shooting the damn gun. Vidahi, thank you the three months. Vidahi, it's called Tether Not Suck. I mean, bro, whatever you want to call it to feel good at your, about yourself at night is fine, but you're getting sucked regardless. Hunter, thank you the membership. See if Pancakes is going to get Brim, uh, appreciate it. heavily punished or heavily controlled once again by the Disney. This is a Bunches. Interesting here that they, Which they team's they winning? We're so crushing right now. We're up these, one game, one, and then we're up this game in rounds. But they're still tra trying to get ready to collapse into a seaside uh, orb tap. Now MXS cutting noise. I liked is this an, a real? This is a real ass op. It was a C pivot. I forgot they have a KJ op. KJ op is so hit, weird. Paint shells, showstopper to the face. A hit. Well, MXS have been able to take that pretty easily and get the plant. Post plants have favored them so far. Deciding to go through tree, throw the boom bot in there. No one's even not the best ult. From TWT. That ult whiffed. Themselves get into position. It's a B hit. But now pivoting over to B. Exploding in two is Mata. And of course, the they got three people heaven. Oh, it whips! Oh, dude. Oh, ew. Brock, ew. Wrong gun for that, bud. One, but this is just so much commotion. Somehow they still got the plant down. Probably. What? Wait, Vic can get a lot here. Never mind. Mame's so aware. Wait, Molly down. Molly down. You need. Oh, we don't have a Molly. Damn. Well, we got three ults off, so that's not bad. KJ ulted, Ray's ulted, and Fade ulted. So it worked out for that, but. I think the Brock heaven play was tough. It was tough. It was a bit of an overheat. And then it made the flank timing for Flya really bad. How do you feel about a Parmesan cheese? What are your thoughts? I'm cool with a Parmesan cheese. Pecorino, if you will. I'll take both. Watch every VOD for four months. VOD Frog, because UK time zone. Thanks for being a humble goofball. Also got a big promotion this month. Cheers. Congrats, Sheldon. Thanks for the five pounds. Thanks for the four pound 99p. He's been 
peek in that sand mound quite a few times. He's actually at the other site. Teleported into rubble. So he's gonna miss out on the action. How'd that miss? What? It did zero damage? Zero. Not a single damage point? Not one? Zero? So we whiffed. We're shooting in the air. An ethereal portal where the rays all goes and no human is. Uh, this damn judge gun, man. Oh, no. It's Jover. It's Jover. It is such a... Zoomed in just to be like, we men, you are... This round is Jover. We we might as well save. The huge utility that came out here from MXS avoided Showstopper, avoided Rolling Thunder, and now you have no choice. Don't you use Judge all the time? Yeah, because I can't aim. Because I'm bad at the game. It's different. He's not allowed to. He's a pro, right? Like get fucking good. To play around that, and it just seems maybe that they weren't ready for that Judge at the entrance of C site. They heard it once and left. then still yeah. wanted to go in. They're like, okay, why do you kill exactly Wingman instead of instead of using? Still died to it. But you know, the crossfire was uh, because set up using the judge play was bait. Um, but, you know, can Pecky get stuff? You, you, it, you get more money if you get the plant down. And then also you're like getting one piece of their win con. So like for one, they get three hundred bucks each. And then for two, like Although it's very unlikely they win and you might win quicker, you kind of guarantee more of a win, I would say. You convert out of that one and now if you don't let it plant at all, how they could play against an operator uh, that mummy brought out very early in this half. Uh, and I like this, right? They, they've been really good at, at controlling some. some a, very come on, come on, come on. And they also get an alt point, and, true. Uh, a sign. But a lot of these, I think quite a, a few of, disadvantages. Uh, no, no real default pulling out rotates. They were really just trying to. Or brute force it to a site, doesn't work. Let's run as a group towards B. Or let's run towards C, group up, work towards C. And All right, a little timeout, never heard nobody. The pulse plant uh, only. So I wonder if they're going to try to uh, maybe utilize and make sure that they, they keep Will and Neptune Guess on the, the game. One side of the angle and then really try to punish Mummy on the other end. Uh, but it's a, it's a tough one to do, right? You're Banjo Kazooie. Uh, a single controller. Uh, being Vic with a brimstone, you can't put a viper wall up to really cut down the line of sight uh, of the operator on the defense. So that might have to be the responsibility Zelda. of Odashima to try to throw a couple of cages here on the A side and really keep uh, that one v one against Mame posted up on that side so they could work somewhere else across it's the map. It's an action platform uh, they, they fantasy. Really still have a lot that they could I got no fucking against, clue. Uh, in terms of the setup that you have for TV, Klonoa? Ain't that okay. the thing in the back of your throat that looks like a punching bag? The seasoning combo here of the defenders that we're looking at least at this point as the bears are coming up for contact to use that util on a side control and since i'm excess like to hit a so fast and so aggressive <laughs> that's a clitoris okay relax this omen at a trying to teleport into rubble and then pressure it down damn tether's crazy how they're blind guys they're blind shoot them That was such a clutch cloaca ain't a cloaca a hole on top of that so the reaction was super quick for TVT when they realized there was no pressure on the a side they instantly broke the door you could throw the seas through the window and then actually caught one player and it just flooded through that that was so nice there that MXS once again weren't really ready for that one too they're going for another buy it's a bird hole around with smaller shields uh but uh, it's a half buy to another half buy, so they're they're still gonna be very healthy uh, in terms of. Derek's busy flying, but he sent me a nice message. He said, "Hey, can't watch today." And I said, "Hey, no worries, T Dog. We've been winning without you. You know, we're good. Miss you." They are four stack C and they ulted C. They are four stack and they've ulted here. We should leave. We should leave yesterday, guys. We did lit them up with that nade, or light them up. Sure, they get Neptune low and some damage into Kanteki, but MXS also have Brock on the edge of life currently. And, you know, MXS, even when they'll lose a player early, if they want the C side... Kevin Davis, thank you for the 25 months. They won't pivot out of this. Kind of like when there was a judge in that corner. Wow, what a fucking ult. 
dragged. That's how they flush out the site is an opening as MXS crawl their way in. Now one player will at the waterfall. Wingman for the plan. Nice flyer. Bomb down for mound. Oh, good shots. I gotta learn this spray. Sitting in waterfall. So MXS has prime position to watch over these areas. Damn, it's just GG. They know that this retake is just not possible. Yep, I want to save the off for the next round. And I, I like the idea of what TBT were doing there on that C site, though. They're like, okay, let's just throw an early pit. And then for MXS... Am I going to watch the Fallout show? Well, uh, no plans to. Or for free, pretty much. I got too many shows right now. I'm watching Shogun, I'm watching Survivor, and I'm watching Freerun. Will and Neptune close. It's a good amount of shows. Hit as deep enough too for you to be able to run out and do a season eight off the top of an orb. How do you feel about that O13 game today? Talking about the one I played. I was playing Valorant last night with Stans. I played a game. We went 13-0. The very next game we went 0-13. How is that possible? How is it possible? Information unless. It's all audible from the orb. So that gamble doesn't pay off. They pay the price. It was a high, high risk, high reward. And fortunately, it didn't pay off in their favor. And MXS the matchmaking's crazy. Salvage at least a, a point again uh, out of TWT and keep their economy quite healthy uh, on this round. Although Mummy, with the rest of the team, able to save the operator. The rest. I mean, you aren't that, that good. Because the then how did I go 13 0? So this is, uh, uh, look, again, you're trying to hurt me. It doesn't work. On, on both teams. I'm trying to say, brother, you're right. How the fuck did I go 13-0 and then 0-13 then? But you're trying to make out of it with as many players as possible, of course. The slow burn from MXS and a different look to even peak this early at B because, you know, last time they did that on Pistol. <laughs> I don't have to remind y'all how that went down. Oh, it's a C angle, folks. Out of this. Gonna open the door and see what procs at the C site. Meanwhile, TWT have good control of a lobby, so good map oh. practice overall from the Yikes! Walks right into it Mata, no! Now they know that. Yep, they were trying to get control of Mount after smoking out towards the entrance. Didn't expect that somebody was gonna be on the ledge, but not. Beautifully done there by Mummy. That makes sense. All right, side. we got nice sight control here. We might die. Wait, 4v5. Nice, Vic! Win winnable, winnable. amazing work for TWT, but the job is not done. One versus three. As Brock just has to keep the spike and the round alive for MXS. Knows where he is. Haunt is oh, dude. They didn't give it to him. Out of TWT. That was so nice. And that I was a really good eye. I hope I'm able to see this in the replay, but I wonder if Neptune was able to throw a seize just before he got hit by that thrash because Will came from behind, got a pain shell kill and two kills right after. And it felt like yeah, if we were able to kill the fade after getting thrash ulted, we had a chance. That was really everything that initiated it, that first pick. And then that now engage MXS to really rush inside the side. There we go. He actually sees all three of them. And then allow Will to get the backstab. That was so nicely done in a selfless play by Neptune to allow, again, this combination. You mentioned it at the beginning of the desk. We want to see I don't think they're still in Canada, no. I don't think so. Neptune could initiate Will into better opportunities for kills. We've seen it a little bit on Breeze, but we're definitely seeing it at this time on Lotus. Now five to five. Both these teams have gone so back and forth. Okay, wait, we have well, this is themselves. Don't know what kind of you know We have no ults. Gal may come through those doors. But I'm excited. It's orb hunting season. That and head over to another side. Bakari sweat, yeah, fuck with it. They've tried that. They haven't been Okay, we gotta clear pancakes. He's up top. For a while. Now with pancakes position, will that be able to stop? <laughs> Yeah, so far so good to try to slow things off. He's out. I mean, he put the one -way smoke okay, we got an A. We got a free A site. This is totally free. They don't know this, but it is free. We've also pulled three rotates. We're going back to C? Look at this. Look at this, and they've totally left C. All right, KJ is here, but it's it's 1v5. 
What the f oh, and, and he's off site. That, I mean, like, you just can't play it better than that. Purely from our door opening in U2, we made everybody leave the site and we got it for free. Five v five post plant. They have two ults though. This is scary. Yep. Oh, that's bad. Yep. Okay, it's GG. <laughs> okay, that was tough. That was tough. He's understanding the path in the MXS currently doing when they're stuck playing inside the site, right? You're playing in a lot of Feels like we were a little bit bunched waterfalls there. I didn't love the uh the post plant position as it were. inside there. But on the attack side, they knew there was a showstopper eventually that was going to come in. And just like they did with the thrash, they wanted to leverage at least one side of that site, which is the waterfall. So that if you lose the main portion of the map, you could still wall bang spray from waterfall back into the site onto that spike. Yet, Will... That's right, we're doing fine, man. Five, we, six rounds, we're happy. Will's playing... Yeah, Will's playing... I mean, he's playing pretty good, but... Honestly, Mame is playing really good. Mame is kind of just locking down a site. And you also have... And not dying. The the Dizzy to use right there with the Gecko to fight towards that spawn. So maybe something they could think about, but they're... I mean, we're in round number 12. So that's something you're going to have to think about for the next time you're going to play Lotus with this comp. We, dude, we're fine, man. Showing a different hand than what they previously played with. Okay, they have an aggressive angle on C, which gives them a lot of util Subtle or info, of not util. Opening up the door, and you know, ideally, Mata not walking into an op this time. It will be Odashima getting his eyes out there. But now oh, we're closing in on ults too, but it's last round, which kind of sucks. Any site, but we get at most one ult here. To a lobby, has the teleport out, does so just in time. Good nade. What? 12 HP? All right, there are three here, but they're they're weak. We win this. We win this. Bad nade. Okay. Oh. Oh. TWT on ankles. Oh, this is for time. This is for time. This is good. No, this is good. Come on! Raise diff. Which allowed MXS to get a couple of these and Tim T started coming back. But now, how he's moving around the site, how he's Bang. seeing his team, the readjustment on that spray, and then also isolating all these 1v1s. There was a little bit of miscoms for TWT on how they wanted to anchor the site. But man, does so good, bro. So good. This time with a Zippo Ace. So good, so dude. Again, see yeah. the same thing as the first map. We end the half six to six. A clean slate one more time. Six, six, six. Script? MXS is going to lose pistol. And Mata was going crazy at the start, too. This wasn't just a one round ordeal. He's the top fragger. In the yeah, I do own a piece of MXS. Reason. Now the tables have turned. And MXS I don't know how much, to be honest. On the defense. And it's 6-6 six, six round, just like in the last map. Is oh, Sky man. gone? Does nobody play Sky anymore? That finished off stronger. Now doing some initial damage into Neptune forces TWT back to spawn. So MXS can measure their aggression quite well. They're gonna make sure they have some bodies at A too. Only on split. And they have a trip Why? On that side, just kind of like using the same role as the. What was the, the nerf? That was really bad. Odashima placing that on that side. Once it gets broken. They oh, that she doesn't have a rechargeable team. flash. MXS that they could. That their decision to stack towards this A site is the right call. Now they'll break this. The TWT position revealed, and that will be. Oh, this is so good for Mata. Mata should get two here. Oh, he should have waited. I feel like he should have waited. Maybe a successful hit. TWT been winning every pistol so far, but this is. You're a dead man. Now the seas. Oh wow. 
They're both trapped on sight. This is good. Has his impact now. Well, our first pistol win in nine pistol rounds. Pistol, depending on how they can deny this plant, and I'm surprised Pancake still has a head after climbing up that rope against Brock. Don't even try it again, bro. But smoke at the back. Time running out. Oh, TWT take over the plant. We won pistol. To take pistol. It's been years. If I had to say that MXS was going to lose pistol, we're going to win pistol, right? That's they always go against me. <laughs> But no, I, to jokes aside, that was that was very nicely done on at least the reads that came out from MXS. Understanding that after the pressure they got, doing damage onto Neptune, forcing the players back, that they're gonna. Try When's the last time we legit won a pistol against Core? Um, three players are grouped up two weeks ago. Trip. They probably think at this point, since Do you think were, pistol's important? Uh, I think winning all, rounds to get to 13 rounds faster than the other team can get, can get to 13 rounds is important. So beautifully done here for MXS to really stack up on the right side. They have a perfect read being called out by Flya. And now winning the pistol and taking a lead in the series. Okay. A little aggro there on Rubble for MXS. But sure scared the you. TWT, but it was really scared as well. <laughs> the Quadra. And no one punishes him. No one even. Well, a slight sneeze went on to Vic. Get your ace, Vic. That round for TWT. Vic wants the ace, and the spike is on the other side of that smoke. And Pecky has to deal with that. The gecko flash manages. Damn it! Live. And, oh, no, no ace for Vic, but still right. a W for MX. We got an ace. Mata got his ace. Continue the confidence that you know MXS has built up since that last round, that run number twelve. So yeah, Mata gets an ace, and then you wanted Vic to get another one too. And also on top of that, if he gets that kill, uh, then oh, or later, ba -da -ba -da. he'll get the whole strike no matter what into the next round if he can get a pick. This is actually quite nice here for MXS. Can Peggy play for Sentinels? Yeah, I think so. A while back. Lud, I think you're my favorite streamer. I literally never felt this much love for a person since the creatures. Ha 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 ha. So long. For uh, the whole server, but also Will has Thanks for the kind words. There too, as a duelist again. So, who are the creatures? Since that, sec uh, that first map on Breeze. Wait, ain't the and creatures the Sly Foxhound? TWT, they're just holding back towards the spawn. MXS has a, a decent bonus round because they have a phantom and an orb that they control. So that was the name of the game. They went for a smoke, full control on Seaside. Now they realize. I only ever watched pressure. Sly Foxhound. Strike in their favor too, and but I didn't watch the group. I just watched Sly Foxhound. Oh jeez. The three-two split out of TWT. Early damage into Kanpeki, but she's just gonna be listening in. See how many rotators has he pulled towards A. And C is pretty barren. Just minus that trip. Yeah. And than that, TWT ready to go. Definitely got to give it to Kim Pecky by lurking up on the east side, pulling all of the defenders out towards the east side. So the name of the game right now for MXS. They don't have the cam yet. Take, which they definitely could with the orbital strike and this phantom in the right hole. And then Kepi, King Pecky, sorry, is the one that's going Damn. to find the fight. <laughs> and here's the cam. Neptune just had to commit, sacrifice himself for the plant, and is successful before the orbital strike could take him out. MXS this is tough. Pancakes can get a lot here. Never mind. MXS blocking off TWT from seeing their own spike, and TWT are losing bodies left and right. And the defuse is being stuck by MXS. So it doesn't matter what happens. MXS take the round. No, Shima stays alive at 5 HP. Yeah, again, Dang, that was a good round of win because now they're broke again. After they engage for that, or did they force last round? But MXS, Why do they sell you're, guns? You're trying to just They're buying. And oh. Trying to keep your opponents at bay Pineapple, thank you the membership. Guard. Appreciate that. As soon as you pull the orbital strike down, you have to run behind that because if you just deny plant or you don't fight with it, then you still give a chance for your opponents to adjust when you have a lower buy. So I MXS is playing good right now. I, I like the way we're looking. Flappy, appreciate it. Just to really not give a chance they did save? To fight back from no Tarek today. He'll, he'll probably Real be here in uh, future weeks. Especially when the uh, the season starts to heat up a bit. Dude, what a waste of util, I feel like. They just use all their util, they got nothing. How to join MXS, I have potential. Rockley poop, I don't doubt you do, but that's above my pay grade. Just got laid off today, if somebody's been fired, what's the next step to becoming a millionaire?
to becoming a millionaire, not, really happy with not working for somebody. This early round, gonna prowl their way it's pretty tough to become a millionaire a working for so someone. Trips, even a camera from MXS, if your goal is millionaire. So you're, you did the right first step. Towards B and then they get flushed out by a paint shell. Everything that TWT wants to do is just getting thrown right back in their face. Yeah, and they're pinned. Really, like, look at where the spike is. Is caught at baby door. <laughs> yeah. Really step one is, uh, so don't work for someone else. Step two is, don't give $5 to a, a millionaire. <laughs> We're at least for that first one. Uh, step three is dinner with Jay-Z. Something TWT can work with. The Neptune coin burns with the spike. And now you got the molly on top of it. At least Will will still go in, make entry, like you said. One enemy remaining. Spike. Going down and will is Odashima clutches somehow for TWT when this round look lost. He may just pull a miracle out of his hat. And he'll need it because he's If he clears team. heaven, we're good. I know we're even near the site as MXS. I guess clearing heaven's kinda hard. To depend on. At least know where will Not the best cam spot. Camera. To bait out the shot, taps the spike. Oh, will will you remains. bite on the bait? Just to on and oh! No, and Fuck, he had it. TWT come out on top. That was so close, and I thought at some point it was a, get, a done deal, no matter what. When Will got those picks, he already had the showstopper too uh, after the plant, and that was like, okay, well, we'll just use that if we need to. Yet he still peeks out. You you called it perfectly. Odashima actually never went into the camera because you're just trying to bait the shot out of the camera being thrown so that you could actually know where you're. Is there a reason he went from Odorous to Odashima? Saw her throw the race on the top of the uh, the same reason it went from Kobe to Kobe to Black Mamba, you know? To have high grounds to fight against a lower uh, same man, Odashima. different beast. Although it's still Odashima you're playing against a uh, uh, two versus one. Sometimes you want to solidify with the showstopper, but at least you count on your teammates to. I guess they need a time. Wait, Will is actually crushing. For Will to have more kills than Mata, and Mata got an ace, is kind of crazy. Really, the, the the spike was um, in a, in a situation that was going to be guaranteeing the round there for uh, TWT towards the end. Yet they got the round. They they and they also called timeout behind that victory that you just got here for TWT because they have a important showstopper. You got a coach for Valorant? No, it was only one I am the coach. The line, I teach so stands. Yeah, I'm caught up on Shogun. They get what 3,300 each for winning the round. I'm bronze three, 1.25 KD. Won our MXS tryouts. Smaller shields, and there you go. Yeah, our MXS freshman team is gonna start getting some people in. And this is an important swing round for their side versus an MXS that does, does MXS have a coach? Yeah. Here, if you're able to convert this for the yeah, we're a real ass team, man. Jeremy, think of the membership. TWT. I feel like you and Som would get along in a watch party. Uh, I like watching Som. I think Som. I deadass think Som, and this is gonna sound weird. I think Som's so cute. <laughs> He's got like uh, boyish energy. You know what I mean? He's 17 years old. Wait. See who or really how many people are okay don't don't go around saying shit like that because now it makes it sound like a damn pedophile went into that entry TWT he's 22 you made me feel like a damn pedophile he's a fucking adult three traveling he's 21 still a damn adult made me feel like a damn pedophile for a moment sights on to see and the smoke i'm not sure if it's still there but mono just let's be sure not to walk into or well will this time not walk into any shots they're just trying to create paranoia right now the alarm bot just got placed too they're hoping that they hear it on the other side you're the one who likes his boyish charm i didn't say that off rip second off don't put quotes around it it makes it weirder you have a late lurk coming out from pen pen pecky sorry towards baby door you know never mind i don't want to do shit with song anymore fuck song trying to see where this offense can go mame Wow, they wanted to go C, but there was a still a guy there. Oh, it's curtains, bro. You're not planning that spike. Be fucking for real. Be fucking for real. You are not planting that. Questions that meme I have, I'm like looking with, with my head tilted and I have three question marks <laughs> over my head until how what was what they my were test. trying to achieve there with the uh with that ult because the night when's your island up for visitors relax p light <laughs> fuck off fuck off dude man uh you know what this is why men can't comment men 
I call him someone all, all of a sudden I'm P. Luddy. Like, come on, dude. That's crazy. That's crazy. And then just have your guy die in the smoke, too. When you're satchel in, I don't. What the fuck were those satchels? There's one thing that works it's paint shells. Very good pressure out of MXS into that A. Three, two, one. Oh, Ooh, a two. second later. And no, it never or earlier. Somehow Attack MXS respond. have pushed up through Sand Mound and have pinned TWT in their own spawn. There is some B space what here for What rank do you say challengers play at? Radiant level? Is like, they're playing uh, all challengers players are... Uh, I guess I shouldn't say all. Challengers Maybe players are better than almost all Radiant players. Yeah, um, on a lower buy too. I mean, they were trying to get that. Like I would say, they're a step above a Radiant player. On uh, Rubble, hoping to get some good trades in. You see these nice traps are being set here on the defensive side of Odashima too. Just a counter. Like Radiance, if Radiance, Radiance are the top one percent, then a Challenger would be like the top one percent of the one percent, and then like a VCT would be the top one percent of the one percent of the one percent. I think this would have been something super important for them to play. But also, what I've learned from really good players is like they have zero respect for rank. Like someone being radiant means almost nothing. It's like the barrier of entry for a conversation on skill. That's about it. Oh, and even hearing the showstopper good back away from Brock. But now TWT can uh, shift their positions. Hearing them walk forward. Kanpeki gets good damage in. Nice, baby. Why? Because what matters is winning. MXS will go up to As a five-man yeah, unit against other five-man units, you know? Good communication, playing your role well. And in ranked, what matters is like hoping to get the better angles against your opponents, but then again, you're playing at a player having fun defenders are coming in from all angles, from mound, from water stats, playing more selfishly. Uh, to really position yourself it's just a different game so MXS, they convert a, a very nice anti is what it anti at least when good players talk to me that's what it feels like hand, uh, for together we're terrific although they they've wasted out the showstopper too on the attack that's another big plus but the big piece right now is also a lockdown that's very close here for together we're terrific yet they're not really trying to leverage that side you see how how on defense they had three guys on that side on C. They were expecting for something to happen for them to try to get that lockdown, but instead they break trip. Wow. That all got fucking yeah. snuffed out TWT instantly by that Molly. Oh, this nade game. could be lethal. Ah. Make the call, no one's here. Go for the pit. Good coverage on this too. MX is just trying. Just put trickle damage around. All right, five v five. They are stacked on site, but they are surrounded. They have people on almost every door. Oh, Vic could do damage right now. In this pit, now the spike is planted. Vic knows there's just someone right on the other side of this, knowing and hearing where the plant came from. The rush in. I get it. Didn't work out. All right, ult drops. Guts one. Nice. Then we're crushing. Exactly what you said. The aftershock from fire. Love you look so cute and boyish today. Thank you. What a normal comment to give someone. And puts two guys out of TWT out in the open on a line left to dry and left to get picked off. And it also cancels out any type of late lurks that was going to come out from Mummy in the end. That was a huge piece of util that got the biggest kill for the round. Are VCT the players and Challengers players that different? Close out the series. Mm, Again, a lot of Challengers players are former VCT players. Die, but usually the, the best Challengers players get poached two, into VCT. With as well. In the same uh, way a really good minor league baseball, baseball player gets brought up to the major leagues. Ash point, series point for MXS. Already causing a rush. The other way around. I might have said it backwards. All right, come on, baby. Come on. Hey, we're hunting wabbits. Get, get, get him. Get his ass, bro. What else? All right, pancakes. 1v4 to stay alive. This is so sad. This is actually so sad. This is so sad. Oh, baby. 
That was amazing. Just it another day in the office for the lads. Over again when they leverage, uh, I like Mata growing the hair out. It looks good. Into different angles on top of that. So you're actually... Uh, over, uh, Mata, grow the damn hair out. Okay, why is the first highlight this? Okay, observers? <laughs> okay, guys, seriously? Like, are we really showing the, the damn massacre? The 411 massacre, really? Here on Lotus to be very aggressive with the rolling thunder. This was really, really nicely done by MXS in the end. Shout out MXS. We are still, by the way, undefeated. One of only two teams that are undefeated in challengers. The other one's M80. Uh so we're killing it, Brent. We're killing it. The team's looking fucking good. This was a very I'm happy we won so hand handily, handedly. I'm happy we won so handedly. Not only a 2-0, but like by five, six rounds. Like it did not look close when we were on our good half. Uh. Anyway, here's the standings. We are 4-0. The only team we have left to play is YFP Gaming, who is currently 1-2. and two. If you guys don't know how the structure works, pretty simple. It's two groups of six teams. The top five from each group are going to move on to the mid-season cup, which is just a giant tournament with all the teams for money and for points. The bottom two are actually going to a promotion relegation tournament. So thinking men in the Glazers, the Glazers more specifically because they've lost four. The Glazers, I think, are... They really have to win their next match against Winthrop. Uh, and then the thinking men really have to win their match against Core. So we'll see. Otherwise, they go to the relegation match. Uh, but we're looking good, man. 4-0. The only team is doing a little better than us is M80 because they're 3-0, but they haven't lost a map, which is quite impressive. But they also haven't played Turtle Troop, who is, I think, the best team in their group. So I'm, I'm curious to watch them. Turtle Troop's playing really well, although they did lose to Winthrop, which was very weird. Winthrop beating Turtle Troop is probably the biggest upset of the season so far. That was a shock. But they, they look they look good again. They crushed GSM yesterday. Can an Ascended team make it to partner within two years? Yeah. Yeah, they can. TSM, they can make it within one year, in fact. You could technically be an Ascended team right now and make it into VCT next year. It'd be hard, but you could. Do you think relegation promotion being introduced for challengers means it'll eventually come to VCT? I don't know, man. I'm not gonna pretend to know the mind of what's what's that dude's name that everyone gets gets fucking mad at? He the riot guy who does all the who who makes makes up this shit. Leo. That's guy. Leo. I'm not gonna pretend to be in the mind of Leo. Anyway, if you guys aren't following, please do me a favor. You can follow our players. Cleaner games than before, so the improvement day to day is showing. Could always be better, though. Let's start winning some pistols. True. Mata. 2 0 TWT Valo, 4 0 in Challengers. And it's a, a push up, a polar bear doing a push up or humping the ground. I don't exactly know what this polar bear is doing. What I was going to say, though, is if you guys haven't uh, already, please follow MXS on Twitter. I'd appreciate it. Give them a little bit of love. There's literally over 10,000 of you in here, and there are 16,000 people who follow this. So we should be able to get to, you know, a good 16 and a half thousand, right? Can I at least 400 of you guys follow? Why? Because it's uh, it helps uh, our teams. It keeps you up to date with what's going on in the world of MXS. Uh, helps the brand become more reputable for sponsors. I don't know. Are those good answers? Twitter is dead, though. Uh, I mean, I hear you, but... Come on, some of you got Twitter still. Come on, some some of us can't help ourselves. All right, let's fucking play a little bit of daily games. I think Stan's is supposed to do a daily games, maybe event at some point. So I'm gonna keep playing daily games for a little bit. I'm gonna retire from them eventually, or at least put them on hiatus. But for now, I'm still in it. And today, it is all in your head. 
It is all in your head, like thoughts. Thoughts are all in my head. Do I have a GH? Can I have a GH? Memories? Memories? All in my head? Mem. 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 Memories? Okay, I don't think memory. Memory. No, I don't think it's in there either. Okay, no memory. What about thoughts? Do we have a G in here? G, there's a G. Do we have an H in here? An H in here. No H. Okay. All right. We're playing hard to get. It's all in your head. It's all in your head. Think? Think? Thinking? Think. Oh, it's all in your head. Brain? Brain? Like my fucking cere cere cerebrum? Cerebellum? My big, beautiful brain is in my head. No. It's not brain. What, Dude, what? It's all in your head. Dude, I know, but what does it mean? Okay, hold up, hold up. It's all in your head. Think about this. It's all in your head. Fake news. Imaginary. Imagination. Imagine. 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 Dude, imagine is definitely one of these. Imagine. Imaginary. Imagine. Imagine. Imaginator. What the fuck, man? Image. Ima How do you spell imaginate? How do you spell I'm looking it up. I don't care. I don't give a shit. I'm looking it up. I M A G I N A T I O N. Okay, that doesn't work. How do you spell imaginary? I M A G I N A R Y. There's no R, bro. An imaginer. Give me a hint. I'm pissed off. Fantasy. Uh, I, 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 I'm, I'm really mad right now. I'm really mad at this one. Because ima imagine's there, man. I'm sorry. I'm getting upset. How about dreams? Dream. Dude, what are we doing? Daydream. Okay. So leave. So leave. Vil, vil, villi, villier, villier. Evil is all in your head. Evil. Vayuz. What the fuck is this word? Civile. Sulaviel. Okay, I'm I'm over it. I do feel like I have the word fake here. Fake knob.
E ma Ima Ima Totoima Ever River Rivers are all in your head. Mentrivers. Lear. What? Rivery? What is that? Isn't that the meeting with all the characters in One Piece? Reverie. It's another word for daydream. But like a French-ass one? The fuck is that? Hmm, okay. Alright, three words left. Am. Gam. Ma- Imagine? So imagine's gone. Or it's different placement. Uh, fuck. I, I hate this week. I hate this one. Or this days. Lent. Figment of your imagination. They, so they have figment, but they don't fucking make believe. Make believe. How the fuck? Make be lee. And then what is this one? Noisily. What it? Il illusion. Oh. Illusion. Okay. Uh, I, 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 I'm removing. I'm removing strands. I, I, I'm officially a strands hater. I don't want to ever play it again. I hate strands. I, I find no pleasure in finding the things. I'm a strands hater. English major, by the way. This is this is the test for English major. Okay, this is for adults. Athlete, a noun meaning a person. What the fuck? Huge, a adjective meaning very large or extensive. What? Are... <sighs> Polenta, a noun well, let's meaning take it off only, made of chestnut meal, cornmeal. I think there's too much emote only with the daily games. It ruins chat. Innocent, a adjective meaning free from legal guilt or fault. Innocent. Whisk. A noun meaning a quick light brushing or whipping motion. Whisk. Molecule. A noun meaning the smallest particle of a sub. Puniness. A adjective meaning slight or inferior. Consternation. A noun meaning amazement or dismay that hinders or. Myoglobin. A noun meaning a red iron containing protein pigment in muscles that is similar. Surrounded. A verb meaning to enclose on all sides. Okay, if I go five for five in the hard mode, I'm feeling good. A sequia. A noun meaning an irrigation ditch or canal. The term is from Arabic al sequia, meaning irrigation ditch via Spanish. A sequia. A noun meaning an irrigation ditch or canal. The term is from Arabic al sequia, meaning irrigation. Lacrosse. A noun meaning a goal game in which players use a long. Digerati. A plural noun meaning persons well-versed in computer use and technology. Digital comes from Latin digitus, meaning finger, used for counting, and erati suggests educated class from literati. Digerati, a plural noun meaning persons well-versed in computer use and technology. Digital- Fuck! Canale, a noun meaning rabble, riffraff, derived from Latin canis through Italian canalia to French. Stalagmite. A noun meaning a deposit of calcium carbonate. Okay. Canale, not even close. Digerati, kind of close. A, not an O. 
a sequia was a C, not an S. Myoglobin is myoglobin. Okay, but I knew that, but that was wrong. Whisk, I, that was a typo. And athlete, that was a typo. I wrote athelt. It, bro, obviously it's a typo. Obviously I know how to spell athlete. Nobody's... I don't know Laura Linney. All right, come on. Give me the Daily Dozen. With a son in the NFL, this four times Pro Bowl defensive back played from 2003 to 2013 and led the NFL in interceptions with the Patriots in 2006 and the Eagles in 2009. He's a defensive back. He played for the Pats in 06. I don't know. Teddy Bruschi. I'm pretty sure he retired with the Patriots. Milton Bradley was an all-star and led the American League in on-base percentage during his loan with this AL West team in 2008. Give me the Seattle Mariners. Taking place in 2021, England lost to this country in the 2020 UEFA or Euro European Cup final and penalties in Wembley Stadium. Was it not Italy? Cars. Investa, Invista, Encore, and Enclave are models produced by what automobile brand? I don't think I know this one off rip. Give me like a country car commercial. The all new Toyota Enclave. No, no, it's all right. Give it up one more time for the Ford Encore and we'll hear it again and again. No. Dodge and Vista. It's a wonderful car. Let's go Dodge. Fuck. Uh, okay. This is Robert Pattinson. And his co-star, Kristen Stewart. The Quaker mascot on the box for this line of cold cereal that comes in varieties. Quaker Oats. Is that, it's literally called Quaker Oats, not, what? It's Quaker Oats. It, fast oatmeal? It's oatmeal. What? The Quaker mascot is on the box for this line of cold cereal that comes in varieties such as brown sugar, cinnamon, and honey nut. The Quaker mascot. It is, isn't it, it's called Quaker. Quaker Oats. Am I crazy? Oh, it's not crackling oat brand. Honey bunches of oats. Oatmeal squares, maybe? Is is oat? It's oats. Uh, fast, quick, ready, make. What do you call it? It's porridge. Por. It's called porridge. Uh. This is crazy. Okay, I'm going to pass for a moment. Starring Jason Segal and Harrison Ford, this dramedy series, Shrinking, debuted on what streaming platform? Shrinking? Was that not Apple TV? Set in Puxatawney, Pennsylvania, Bill Murray plays a cynical weatherman who gets caught in a time loop in Groundhog Day. Puxatawney Phil, the name of the groundhog, with a husband and wife, Wynn Butler and Regine Chassange as lead vocalists this canadian album or canadian rock band won grammy for album of the year 2011 for the suburbs canadian uh, i looked up canada what's the band name husband wife duo 
Canadian, and they won Album of the Fucking Year. That's a big ass deal. Um, uh, Mumford and Sons. They have Canadian vibes. I don't think it's a, a husband wife. The ABBA reunited. Uh, how about the plain white tees? For whatever reason, I feel like it starts with the. They give me nothing. They give me nothing. Asher, <laughs> Asher Roth. All right. The Quaker mascot is on the box for this line of cold cereal that comes in varieties such as brown sugar, cinnamon, and honey nut. I, I feel like a crazy person. Is it Captain Crunch? No. Are you going to sit here and tell me Tony the Tiger is a Quaker mascot? Uh, I'm just... I'm just going to go oatmeal squares because I'm pissed off. It's not Cheerios, just because Honey Nut Cheerios exists. The B is not a Quaker mascot chat. Oh, I was right. It's just oatmeal squares. Oh. Easy. Yeah, we ate a lot of oatmeal squares growing up down in New Hampshire. You know, it was not one of the bad places. I was going to say the brand name is just Quaker. So it's kind of a silly question. They're like, what is the company with the Quaker mascot? The question is the answer. It's Quaker. But I didn't know they had a cereal called Oatmeal Squares because I just ate their oatmeal. Five for nine is pretty good. Music, it was Arcade Fire. So Asher Roth was close. Cars, it was Buick. Oh, the Buick Encore. I would not have gotten that. It was a Rangers, and it was Asante Samuel. Who's his son? Who's his kid? Thank you, Naxanax, for the membership. Who's Asante Samuel's kid? Debo? No, you're kidding me. Are you being fucking for real right now? No, you're not. It's actually just Asante Samuel Jr. Who is a cornerback who plays for the Chargers. Okay. All right. Copy. Copy. All right. Let's do some time guesser. Recently, Stans has been kind of dogging me on time guesser. He keeps saying that like, I never score under 40K. I dust you on time guesser. And it's, it's making me feel bad about myself. So anyway, I'm here to hopefully write herstory and destroy Sands. Okay, this is a bunch of Korean dudes running together. <laughs> I mean, that's just what we're looking at. Bunch of Korean dudes all running together. This says Italia, which is like, what's that about? Why does that say Italia? That's a German flag. They're all holding Olympic flags. Now, this building is obviously Korean. So where in the world are we? And then follow up, when in the world are we? There's no question that this is the Olympics. It says Seoul on it. So I'm assuming this is the the Seoul Olympics. I don't know when the Olympics were in Seoul, though. I'm not going to pretend that I do. But very clearly, we are in Seoul. I'm assuming by some capital building. All right, maybe this is the plaza. Maybe this is the cathedral. Maybe this is Sung Nyomen. Or maybe this is another area that I've uh, not yet bastardized the name of. 
So let's just go right. Is this a bridge, you think? Let's go like right here. As far as when, so the Olympics have been every four years. It's happening this year, 2024. This is definitely a Summer Olympics. I'm pretty sure if I go back in my lexicon, that's not the right word. 2028 LA, 2024 Paris, 2020 Tokyo, 2016 was... I forget, Germany? No. I forget what 2016 was. It was not Korea. 2012's Rio, right? 2008's Beijing. 2004. 2004. Wasn't that like Athens? Shit. I don't know. I'm losing it. I, I think... I think it wasn't 2000. I don't think it was 96. I'm pretty sure 96 was in America. 92 or 88. Going off the car, I want to say 1988. But it could be 92. I'm going to go 92. Or maybe I go 90 and I split the difference. But, ah, fuck. It also could even be older. Let me let me just go off the car. Because that's my only real intel on the year. My dad drove a Saab. And it looked a lot newer than this shit. Let's go 1984. Let's lock that in. Let's go in front of the plaza near City Hall. And let's guess. It was 84. Okay. I should have gone with my first guess, but I feel fine about it. The Olympic torch being carried through Seoul a day before the ceremony. The location was excellent. The year wasn't bad. It was 1988. We go next. Kuwait Airways. I want to say we're in Kuwait. The question is why is it so damn packed at the airport in Kuwait? And then the follow-up question is, where's Kuwait? We figured that one out. I don't think it's Kuwait, pro like, the, actually the airport, is it? Someone's, like, visiting Kuwait. I feel like we're downtown Kuwait City and someone's visiting. Or maybe Okay, the issue is maybe this is just an ad and we're not in Kuwait. Cause those are Greek characters. And those are Greek flags. So maybe now we're in Greece and we're not in Kuwait. And that says Athena. All right, I'm going back. I don't think we're in Kuwait anymore. I think we're in Athens, Greece. I don't see the damn Parthenon. So I don't think we're in the Parthenon. I think we're in this square because it has water. So I'm going to go right here. And this says Athenas. And this says Athena. So, you know, that seems good enough to me. So we're in Athens, Greece. What are we doing in Athens, Greece? Like, when is this? Could this be the Greek Revolution? 
I don't know if they had one. I'm just wondering if that could be what it is. What is it? <coughs> to sneeze. Okay. It's the it's the Greek separation from a country. Greek, it is Greek something. Let's assume, based off this vehicle, it is 1962. I actually feel really good about this year. Let's go 1962, Greece, run it. It was 1973. My location was excellent. It was 10,000 members of the Greek General Confederation of Labor gathered in protest of the right-wing military dictatorship Greek Junta. 73, wow. They really had to throw this bitch in. Like, we didn't have black and white back then. Or I should say we did have color. Why are they making everything black and white? Escobar de la Justicia. Gano el terror. Okay, this is actually really easy. Because we can see the calendar, and it says Jania, which means January. So all we have to do is figure out what year the 1st of January fell on a Saturday. And then, very quickly, we will find out what year we are in. The only issue is if this is actually June or July. Janvier, Février, Mars, Avril, May, June, July. It's June or July 20th. Hmm. Oh, it's the 20th of June, 1991. Okay, now the second thing we need to find out is where in the world we are. Because presumably we're in Mexico. Based off, oh. Oh, fuck. But maybe not. So the language is Spanish, which could be Mexico, or all of South America, or most of it, I should say. This says, on peso, a, a, on peso hacia La Paz. La Paz is the capital of Bolivia. This over here says... San Andreas, which is the fault line? Could we be in Bolivia? I feel like this says Argentina. So I feel like we could be in Argentina. I feel like I'm overthinking it. La mesa, that means the table. En un idiota. What are they saying in here? Jeez. Oh, fuck, man. Escobar tras le las rejas. El Tiempo, The Times. I wish it would just say, like, Mexico newspaper. El Mundo, The World. Triunfo de la Justicia.
Wait, this is some intel over here. No, it's not. Okay, I, uh, my body rationally thinks maybe I go Mexico. The replica of the orangutan. What? Oh, a clone? Is that what that means? Did they clone an orangutan back in 1991? I feel like the further I zoom in, the harder it is to read. El Espectador. Wait, wait, wait. Huh. Okay, I think they're not using... What is the currency in Mexico? I don't think they're using it. Do they use a different currency in Mexico than South America? Because I'm, I'm seeing this costs 200. Which I'm like, that's steep. But I didn't think... That's how it worked in damn Mexico. Oh, shit. Cut me some slack here. Um, you know, we're getting there. I got the year perfect. Ugh. Okay, Pablo Escobar. Operated. Wait, famously out of Colombia. Right? Like the cocaine capital of the world. I was wrong. No, I was right. Why did I spend half a year there? Do they use pesos in Mexico? Do they use the same pesos in Mexico that they do in South American countries? What is the USD to Mexican peso? One dollar is worth 16 Mexican pesos. And one dollar is worth 3,800 Colombian pesos. So I was right in the sense that the value of a Mexican peso is way higher. Like there's no way it would cost 200 for a newspaper. Right? All right, keep going. Keep it going. Uh oh. Photographia. Sachi. Something tour. Pristoge. Okay. They're not giving us much. It's a European town. It looks like it could be damned. It looks like it could be damn Slovakia or Hungary. It could be could it be Budapest, maybe. Do they even have the accent on the S there? Not really. I feel like it's Slovakia. Could it be Poland? Let me go Slovakia. Let me go 1955. Let me call it a day. Nineteen sixty one, it was Prague. It was Czechia. Shit. Okay. Not the worst location, not the best year. Uh we have school children playing uh ice hockey in a frozen over town 
uh, up in sh- Sweden. What with her blonde hair. We're outside of Stockholm. The kids are playing on ice outside Stockholm. In 19... Eighty four nineteen seventy one Iceland. Wow, fuck, that's a bad, that's a bad day, that's a bad time yesterday. Stands is way better. Okay, okay, well. You know, usually I'm better than that. Ethan O's, thank you the 20 gifted. Spy, SP5 Uck, sp, sp, Uck, thank you the 10 gifted. Ethan O's, thank you the $20. I've been loving Unpaid Intern. Are there any more episodes in the works? Yeah, every month. You know what I beat Sands at is Luddle. I attempted the hardest gaming challenge in the world. Easy. I'm not playing Lotto today. Logan, thank you very much for the membership. Appreciate it. I'm not playing Lotto today, guys. Not happening. Hello, Ludwig. How are you doing today? I wanted to wish your mods a happy mod appreciation day, which I know you've probably already done. How about a fun game of naming all of your mods and something you like about them? Dude, wait, that sounds so fun, but oh no, it's the end of the stream. No, dude, that's so unlucky. Otherwise, we would have been able to name every single mod, which would have been such a fun stream idea. Chat, here's my game plan. I am going to end because I need to do a parasocial club stream. Uh, so I actually just went live. I wanted to watch my Valo team. Uh, but I gotta watch, I gotta, I gotta do a parasocial club stream. It is a YouTube channel review. Uh, here's my game plan actually for the rest of the night. So right now it's 4 p.m. I'm going to go live, do a parasocial club stream. It's going to take me about an hour. I'll be done around five o'clock at five o'clock. I'm probably going to go work out tonight around seven o'clock. I'm going to do another members only stream available to all members. If you are a member that even pays a dollar a month, I'm going to be playing hell divers with Clint in mango. Uh, maybe I'll do a regular stream, go live before it, or maybe I'll do it on a regular stream. I haven't decided fully yet, but that's my game plan. We're doing three streams today. So we got this stream. I'm going to go do a parasocial club stream, which is YouTube channel review. This guy's charging 10 buck for a YouTube channel review. $6. Rather, $6. And, uh, and yeah, I am. Uh, and then, and then tonight, uh, yeah, maybe I'll just do a regular... Uh, Hell Divers. Let me message a group chat right now. So, anyway, that's the game plan. Daniel, thank you very much for the membership. Yard gaming when? Uh, I gotta track them all down, man. I gotta track those, those dusty, dusty bastards down. Pandroid, thank you for joining the uh, upgrading. Appreciate it. Any Balotro? I think I'm retired from Balotro, at least for a while. After doing the gold stake, I feel pretty good. I don't feel. I don't feel like the need to like run something else, you know? Thank you very much for the upgrade. Random. 
Uh, anyway, chat, I am wrapping up right now. Yeah, I'll probably play the new update. What are you drinking from? One of those uh, California waters called Mountain Valley. I just use it as a water bottle. <laughs> I still can't drink too well, though. Muffin Sports Cards. Thank you, the Bear Social Club. Joining joining the Bear Social Club. Dude, I fucking <laughs> I can't breathe. Who's mounting their valleys right now? <laughs> what does that even mean? All right. YouTube channel review. Did you see Boom Boom Gonza getting hacked? Boom Gonza. I don't know who Boom Gonza is. So no. All right. Bang. When's the RD&D? Uh, coming soon, TM. April, maybe? Uh, Alright, chat. I'll be back hopefully later tonight, if not tomorrow. That's my game plan. He's the shorts guy? What do you mean? Oh, this guy. Boom Zonga. Wait, what happened to him? You just got hacked? Hopefully it'll get fixed. Lindsay, thank you for the five gifted. His channel got removed. Oh, what the fuck? Well, I assume it'll come back up. I hope. But if it doesn't in a day, let me know. I'll hit up with someone about it, YouTube, if I can. Uh, all right, chat. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I am out. Thank you all for watching. I will see you later. Goodbye. See you later. Goodbye. See you later, guys. Goodbye. Stream either tonight or tomorrow. Peace.